grade 8 math number 2.2b, write a number in scientific notation, the positive power of 10. So, as we said in the previous video, scientific notation is a way of writing very large or very small numbers as whole numbers or decimals, multiplied by a power of 10. The numbers used in science can be extremely large or small, so scientists use scientific notation to write quicker. 93 million can be written as 9.3 times 10 to the 7th. There's 7 hops to get in between this 9 and this 3, and that's what gives us our 7 for an exponent. If we've got a decimal, we can move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 hops to behind the 3, and it could be written as 3 times 10 to the negative 5. See? When we went this way into the decimal, we made a negative exponent, when we moved to the left, we made a positive exponent. The 5 hops towards the right equals a negative 5 as an exponent. So when we see the 9.3 times 10 to the 7th power, this number right here, this 9.3, it has to be greater than or equal to a 1 and less than a 10. That's what needs to go here. There must be at least one digit in front of the decimal point. That's why we put it in between the 9 and the 3 when we did it from this number, from the 93 million. You can't put 0.93 times 10 to the 8th. That would be wrong. You need one digit in front of the decimal point, so this is correct. See? Got to have that one digit in front of there, all right? So to change between standard notation and scientific notation, we can count the number of places the decimal point moves. So remember, standard notation is the normal way we write numbers, like 7,500. Scientific notation would be taking the 7,500, and it would be writing it as 7.5 times 10 to the third power. See? So standard is our regular way. We can change between standard and scientific. When the number is greater than or equal to 10, we use a positive exponent. 75,000, the decimal points here, we would go 1, 2, 3, 4 hops to get in between the 7 and the 5. Those 4 hops end up becoming the number that the exponent will be. See? The decimal hops 4 places to the left, we use an exponent of 4. 7.5 times 10 to the 4th. A light year is the distance light can travel in one year. One light year is 9,461,000,000,000 kilometers. If we counted all these hops from the decimal point being right here, we would count 12 hops for us to get in between the 9 and the 4 right here. 12 hops. So we can write this in scientific notation as 9.461 times 10 to the 12th. Because we did 12 hops, that's our exponent, see? We made sure there was one digit in front of the decimal point. This number right here must be equal to or greater than 1, and it should be less than 10. The reason it has to be greater than 1 is if there were no number in front of the decimal point, then it would be less than 1. See that? So by having the rule that there has to be a digit in front of the decimal point, well, that means it's got to be a 1 or bigger. And it's got to be less than 10, because if this number were bigger than 10, we would be able to change the exponent to a 13 instead of a 12, because it would be one bigger, see? And at least one digit must be in front of that decimal point. So those are the rules, all right? So in our next video, we're going to talk about changing a number from scientific notation to standard notation, okay? So... Remember, I'm on Twitter, and if you'd ever like any of these whiteboards for study material so that you could save the file or print a picture of it, just go to my Twitter and ask me. And don't forget to hit the like button if my videos are helping you. And also don't forget that my videos are ad-free, and if you'd like to help support me, I'm on Patreon.com. Okay? I'll see you next video. Bye.